to be reckoned with in the Cruiserweight division. A true Broad Street bully. Introducing the challenger from Robbinsdale, Minnesota, weighing in at 220 pounds, Johnny Blaze. Introducing the champion from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 193 pounds, he is the ECW Middleweight Champion, Drew Gulak. Don't go anywhere. This matchup has the potential to be special. We could be moments away from an instant classic. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid Ouch. for this. Well, actually, hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. This might be it! Oh, my! We've seen champions head into matches maybe a little too confident, only to be picked off in the end. And guys, I can't help but wonder if we're going to see that again here tonight. Oh, nasty impact. Here's a cover. Speaking of champions heading into matches a bit overconfident, one of the most glaring examples of that would have to be the honky-tonk man's attitude heading into his Intercontinental Championship defense at SummerSlam 1988. We all know what happened to him on that night. <laughs> you are so right, Michael. That was great, of course, though. It wasn't so great for the honky-tonk man who ended up losing his championship to the Ultimate Warrior in fewer than 30 seconds. As we say in the trade, guys, the monitor area in the locker room is likely sold out for this one, as there are plenty of superstars with a vested interest in the outcome of this match. To Byron's point, there are several competitors on the roster who can make the case for being the next in line for a title opportunity. However, a lot of that, of course, depends on the outcome of this match here tonight. And with that in mind, regardless of their personal feelings, you'd have to think the locker room is rooting for the champion here tonight. The last thing they want to do is to have to wait even longer while the champ's rematch clause kicks in. from a three count, I can tell you that. Gonna take more than that. The challenge is starting to slow down a bit here. Well, he knew the champion wasn't going to go down easy here tonight. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. A lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better, but that doesn't mean we can't see an upset here tonight. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Wow. Nailed it. That was simply amazing. Uh oh, it's locked in, the armbar. Can he end it here? 
as Byron was talking earlier about, oh, and he breaks free. But the damage might have already been done, Michael. He wants no part of the outside. Oh, yeah. oh, this is dangerous right here. Look out, look out. This could be this attack. This one is over. The night could... This is unbelievable. The championship changes hands. Now let's take a look back at some of the great action. This was another great moment. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. Singles win here, guys. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that was an amazing contest.